CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers. Chance is getting too much investigating Jeremy and Tong him into prison. The case of Nikki's necklace is an extremely troublesome case, but in the end, he escaped the crime. Jeremy returned to Genoa and confidently declared to everyone that he was innocent. Chance, too, asked whether anyone intervened in this, and Chance ev- changed evidence or not. The evidence of the scene left and felt and left Jeremy's traces, while he had never appeared there. Chance is only alone, no more Paul or Ray because they're gone. Chance is depressed with their current job, lacking quality allies, loving jobs and happiness of a career. There's no one. Chance knew that this was at his fault and unable to find the teammates. Paul's unexpected ret- to return, but suddenly Jeremy is Paul's younger brother, and he was protected by a strong, intelligent, and respectable police officer. As Paul, does he have an impact on the investigation and change? If so, he'll never accept this. Paul didn't want to receive criticism, but he wanted to send a message to Chance that forgives his brother's mistakes. Paul is back, but will he be a police officer? He's in the retirement age, but if he wants to be a detective, it's possible because his investigation experience is always appreciated. Jeremy was happy when his brother appeared, and he didn't expect that Paul was respected again. So now Jeremy will act publicly, disregard the law, and not be afraid of anyone. What will the relationship for Jeremy be? Paul will draw a chance to open a detective office with him, giving up the job at the police department. He will be in prison, pressured and tried by the decisions that are always affected to in a negative way. Chance will have to think again, and because Victor has invited him to Newman Enterprises before, he refused because he thought he didn't need to do so. Victor was not a reliable person, and his, he will lose his worthy reputation.